Hello and welcome back dear friends, it's me Odo and we are back in our campaign with Oda uh, soon it won't be Oda but Japan because we are now integrating Ito as well um, we will be ready with this in I don't know when soon enough probably with a minus uh, we only pay free at the time. Yeah, that's that's tr not nice. That's because we um, integrated so many uh, subjects now that we have uh, uh, some madly. I mean. They don't like us anymore. Would it be better if we improve relations with them? Mm. Probably. I don't know. Anyway, um, we did uh, the first wars here on the continent, uh, not on our island, and we uh, captured these two provinces and a lot of money from Korea. <coughs> We also humiliated Korea, so we are now at power projection 60, which is okay for a while. Um, to produce more um, monarch points, uh, we now want to get rid of the rebellions. We probably can't get rid of these rebellions here, but. Um, Really, we lost our we lost our claim here. We probably should build spy networks here again. I really don't know if this will be important because w um, uh, at the moment when we are Japan, we uh, get claims on Korea. Um, I was also thinking about. Um, the idea groups. Uh, the next idea group should be probably a, a administrative idea group and as we get a lot of um, a lot of uh, what's it called um, missions concerning uh, um, not Korea, but um, Taiwan and um, the islands, the Kurils and stuff like that. Uh, we will probably 1.9. Why are you so mad at me? I mean, you weren't that that mad at me before, uh, and that's because of the religious unity. We don't have it anymore to a hundred percent, and we have overextension. The overextension will be gone hopefully soon enough. And after the re this, we will tackle the religious unity. Yeah, uh, maintain the diplomat. So, uh, we have two diplomats who does don't do anything. So we will probably will probably start to. I think we also get a claim on Ryuko, so we don't have to build a claim on Ryuko. But we should do more claims here. I mean, there is only two countries in which direction we can um, expand right now. It's Yeren and Korea. 
we can't get claims on Ming at the time. And I really don't know if we should try to, to attack Ming. Anyway, we also want to um, get colonial colonialization colonialism <laughs> nah, not in Echiko here it is we started it here we are at 60 per 65 75 57% uh, let's see if we can get better and there is the revolt in Ainu Hey, we've got an heir and he's quite good. 352 is a bit better than expected. Chicago. So. Uh, 13,000 troops here. Yeah, we will tackle the uh, Chicago rebels first get them down now why should we do that go up them rebels so now we can this is also already a so we will uh, do the religious unity here and we will start working here and we will bring this to Shinto religion as fast as possible. So Tokachi is also part of our state now. these rebels again with the overextension nearly gone we will get rid of this rebels as well and we are back on track <coughs> so let's see There, there should be some outraged countries there out there. <laughs> so we have also the Kamikawa. Normally this should go down now to below zero. extension should be down even further now. Uh, anyway, how about this year and stuff? A 
let's do even more in a courthouse. So, how about you getting even further up? 66, 71, 76, 81. End of the Voku order is restored. End incident Voku. Order gets end of Voku until. Uh, blah blah blah, giving the following effects trade efficiency plus 20%. Oh, that's nice. 50 years. <laughs> um, how do I see? Oh, cool. How do I see if I took only the Isolationalist stuff. Since a nation's willingness to adopt ideas and technologies from abroad can range from open to close. Ah, there it is. Our current isolationism level is selective integration. Level 2. Ooh. Construction cost minus 10%, idea cost minus 10%. That's nice. Nation would get the following effects. With uh, open doors we get better technology costs. With level 4 closed doors, we've got stability cost modifiers and monthly war exhaustion down. Hmm. Now is a good level. Minus 10% construction, minus 10% idea. I don't want to, to leave this level 2. Ooh, level 1 was also good. Development cost minus 10%, institution spread plus 10%. Yeah. You can't have everything, can you? Yeah, in the end they are not very happy with us. You would expect that. Probably up here. Stop. Sale of titles. Gold is a sign of nobility. Hmm. Merchants get more loyal. That's good. Ooh, stability is also good. We don't want the merchants to be disloyal, but so we'll take the ducats. We can probably. We should do decks. Docks. No, how do I. Oh, shipyards. Naval force limit plus two. We probably should build shipyards.
because we want more ships. I mean, we are an island nation, so we really need more ships. Uh huh. That's okay. We really don't want to claim it anyway because we are integrating it now. So, what's that? That's a cog. Move there. Mm -hmm. So marital bliss, Her Majesty the Queen is of course a constant companion and good advisor in her own right. However, apart from the role, our Queen is also a representative of the Crown to the Yamato House and vice versa. At times, this is not an arrangement without benefits. Today, Tama seems very pleased to announce that her family has decided to show its support for the throne and for the union of Nobutaka the first and Tama. May this unison bring benefits to us all. More money, more prestige. I really don't know what this prestige stuff does. <coughs> I'll take the money. I'll take the money and build another shipyard in Setsu. That's okay. So, how about my trade? We've got 52% trade in this node now. My Shukun, we have finally managed to convert the heretics of Shirbe. Yeah, that's good. That's good. We want to do this more. Let's move on to Tokachi. If they're all Shinto, then We can close our country even more. <laughs> more money. The last shipyard in Suruga. Age of Reformation. Yeah, that's bad. Because we probably... We probably don't get many bonuses here. Unified culture. Own all provinces of your own, your culture group. Own all provinces of your culture group. Hmm, that's probably faster to achieve than thought. Asian trade. Gain it Gain the trade bonus from either silk, spices, or china wear. Hmm. That's probably also possible. Convert another nation? Yeah, probably not. Create a colonial empire? That's probably possible. And uh, convert provinces also. Because we want the Shinto religion to become predominant in um, in Eastern Asia. I mean, I'm not, not playing this for um, what's it called? Efficiency. But only for the role-playing stuff. <laughs> okay. 
there are a lot of nice bonuses probably here uh, so we want to do many of these let's convert more land and let's conquer more land I really don't know if we if the Kurils have also the Japanese culture. Hopefully not. Probably Ryuku. But even them I don't think so. So yeah. Let's make them into a state. And after we missionary stuff here so Yeren uh, yes let's take them here to Ulch get rid of these rebels I mean when they fire and they will fire we will have enough troops here to we're going to Suruga Yeah, whatever. Uh, what did we do now? Hmm. I didn't look what happened. So, our truce with Korea and Yeren and Ainu will expire 1513 and 1515. So, we've got some time now. Yeah, anyway, uh, for today I will say thank you for watching and next time we'll um, we will see probably uh, now we've got 25% probably this this session so next time we'll probably see the integration of Ito and hopefully the creation of Japan of the great nation of Japan hmm. until then I wish you a pleasant evening good night and sleep well